This was the craziest story. Outrageous. Devastating. Insane. Randall Emmett is sketch at best. Randall Emmett, Hollywood movie producer. Lala Kent, reality star, Vanderpump Rules. Hollywood. The lifestyle, the Rolls Royces, the Jets. He paid so much just to have status. Hollywood. Vanderpump Rules, it's about these young, hot 20-somethings. This is the juiciest time in reality show history. How could I not have been smarter? Like, I beat myself up daily. How is my daughter having to pay for my stupidity and me keeping my blinders on <laughs> and not wanting to see red flags? Who was Randall Emmett, really? Randall was publicly at an apex of his career. He worked with Bruce Willis. Martin Scorsese. 50 Cent. But really, behind the scenes, things were already starting to fall apart. 50 Cent suddenly goes on Instagram and says, Randall, you owe me $1 million. Then 50 Cent posts, money by Monday, Randall. Hollywood. He made a fateful decision to go on camera on Vanderpump Rules. I literally would not know the name Randall Emmett if I didn't see him on Vanderpump Rules. The lawsuits. Over 30 lawsuits. He was awful too. Everyone. It just came off as someone who was extremely self-absorbed. I was a personal assistant for Randall Emmett. An executive assistant. I was Randall's assistant for almost a year. My first interaction with Randall was him in his underwear. A bag of cocaine. Totally naked. The N-word being used is where I draw the line. This is certainly the underbelly of Hollywood. It's not the part that you see on the postcards. Randall and Lala's relationship started to fall apart. To have your daughter living her life that way made me feel very sad. I hate Randall Emmett. It's just astounding that he's somewhere still playing the victim when what he has actually done is damage and hurt other people. I have to put up a big fight. I do hope he gets what he deserves. The Randall Scandal. Love, Loathing, and Vanderpump. Welcome to Hollywood. Only on Hulu.